So this question is about the pileotrophic gene. What do you mean by the pileotrophic? It is a Greek term. Pileotrophy. Pileotrophy. Pileon means more and trophy means way. It means one gene influences two or more seemingly unrelated phenotypic traits. Basically what we say in genetics is one gene, one enzyme, one trait. That means one character. So for each and every character one enzyme is responsible that is controlled by the one gene. That is what we are able to say, we used to say. But here there are some exceptional cases which you call it as the pleiotrophic genes. The, these pleiotrophic genes are there which can control more than one trait. So for example here you can say gene X. Gene X is a single gene but it controls three traits. Trait 1, trait 2, trait 3 and these three traits or they are unrelated to each other. All these three are different in their properties and then where it occurs like that. So the best example for this filiotrophic gene is the phenylketonuria. Phenylketonuria is one of the um, effect which is, ca is uh, caused due to the mutation in a single gene. And this phenylketonuria is caused by a single gene which underwent a mutation. When it underwent, uh, when it is mutated, the, actually this gene is PKU gene is responsible for phenylalanine hydroxylase enzyme. So when this enzyme is arrested or when this enzyme is not secreted, then what will happen? The main effect is phenylalanine is not converted into a tyrosine. This is the main effect. In addition to that, it is able to produce many uh, other effects also. That is mental retardation, eczema and then pigment defects are also occur due to the phenylketonuria. So thus this PKU gene is responsible for the four different characters. One is for this enzyme that is phenylalanine hydroxylase and then for mental retardation, eczema and pigment. So when a single gene is responsible for more than one character, that gene is called as the pleiotrophic genes. So that is the thing. C is the correct answer for this question.